Howdy folks, Luke Simons with you. Back to the Basics 101. Yeah, I'm in a vehicle and yeah, there is no door. There is no dash. There is no nothing really. Thank goodness we have brakes. Today I'm going to show you how you use a tow rope to tow. This is one of my dad's work vans and my brother tore this thing apart because the parts are valuable. It's got a good transmission in it. They've stole countless parts off of it already, including the door. I'm kidding you not. State representative. Feels like I'm in a parade. It's really nice. As I see him slow down, or I see something ahead, I keep constant pressure on that. As you can see he's telling me to stop with his hand. I got my foot almost to the floor. And now I stopped him. A little tension on the rope. It's getting a little drafty in here, actually, technically speaking. <laughs> okay, as we're driving, we're kind of going down a hill right here, and the window's really dirty. This is just a parts van that we're moving across town. My dad called me up early this morning after men's breakfast, and we're just pulling it across town, and you can see. Uh, we just came down a small hill. Uh, you probably can't see with this window like this. I got my foot on the brake. Now we're going uphill, so I'm gonna let him get some speed. At this point, I have no battery, so I have no flashers. Um, do have a couple people following me. I don't know how fast we're going, it doesn't say. The speedometer cable must have been taken out as well. And I'm just letting my dad tow me along here. And I try to keep my eyes out in front of him, just in case somebody would try to pull out in front of us that I could really, really slow him down. He will not hit the brakes, folks. He won't. I have to be his brakes. I'm the one who's stopping him. Coming up to a stop sign. Be slowing him down here in minutes. Okay, we're just coming up to the graveyard. That means a stop sign is coming. So the idea is, is to keep that tow rope stretched out, stretched out. Okay, now I'm really pressing down on the brake. I'm gonna get him on the stop sign. He's gonna wave me along when he can see it's clear for the both of us to make it. Oh, got a little bit of slack in that tow rope. She's a brisk morning, folks, I'm telling you. Okay, we got the go ahead. Foot off the brake, let him have it 100%. No power steering, so just take those curves nice and neat. So I'm watching his hand right now because he can see out there better than I. And he did not hit the brake the whole time he was there. Okay, he's giving me the go ahead here. Okay, this is nerve, a little bit nerve-wracking, but I've towed with my dad for many years. My dad made us buy our own vehicles, so a lot of times you bought older vehicles when you were a kid, and um, you learned how to tow your vehicle. <laughs> you just did. It was part of growing up. So that's what, uh, yeah, that's how I was uh, cruising around town there. <laughs> Here. Just hooked her around the stabilizer there. Some kind of YouTube video or what is this? Yep, you're famous. Okay. Are you trying to show how humble you are as a legislator? Or? Yeah, that too. That too. It seems like I've done this better before. Yeah, when you're on camera, sometimes all the fame goes to a guy's head. And then, so the basic hand commandments, yeah, right till I lock it. Basic hand commandments are this, like this. This can be stop, and this is definitely a hard stop. Like, and this here is gentle go, like nice and easy, slow. That's what the hand signals are. So when he's out of his window, that's how that would be. Well, folks, that's how you tow a van with no door. And all vehicles are somewhat similar. 
This one just happened to be a specialty, a custom, a van with no door. Well, folks, thank you for watching. May the Lord guide and keep you. Until next time, this is Luke Simons. Happy trails.